Hi everyone, this is Jenny from Jenna's DIY Studio and today I'm going to show you how to do a unicorn horn. In this project, we're going to start from the top and then all the way down. So when you're working, you're going to be seeing this way from here to the top. So first of all, you're going to need your hook and your scissors and your yarn. Now here I have a I have a bigger hook and two strands of yarn because I want you to see how it's done. So I always start with a magic circle and for this case we're gonna do pull the yarn through one chain and we're gonna do four single crochets inside that magic loop magic loop for those that don't remember need a refresher a single crochet is pull the yarn then you have two loops and then pull it again that is your single crochet so i have one two and this is three and this is four now i'm going to the next row now the thing is i'm not gonna slip stitch i'm gonna keep on working on the next stitch look what i'm gonna do i'm gonna go to the next one and in this one i'm gonna do one single crochet and on the next one i'm gonna do two single crochets this one is one and two and now i'm gonna do one on the next three single crochets so this is one we go to the next one this is two and this is three and we're gonna keep on working the same pattern until we have the size that we want okay and as you see when i pull it it starts creating the horn so now let's go to the next three of them so it's one single crochet on the next one that is our first then another one on the next one remember single crochet and then single crochet again and on the next one that is we already did three now this one is going to be two single crochets so it's one and two now the next one is going to be one next one is the second one so it's going to be one again and the next one is going to be one again okay so it's always going to be one two three one single crochet in each one and then on the next one it's going to be two single crochet in the same space see this one is going to be two single crochets see and now we go again so it's one and we have two and we have three and then the next one two again one and two and you keep on going until you have the length that you want as you see here, I keep on doing two single crochet in one stitch and then one single crochet on the next three stitches and you keep on doing until you have like two inches long, I will say like one inch and a half, almost two. And you see how it's like a pyramid here, like a cone. So on the last stitch, you just do a slip stitch at the end that is pulled through pull here and then chain one to secure your work and you're gonna cut a few inches long because you want to sew it okay pull here and then you have your horn 
because when you have your drip pry it, you want to sew it to it. See here, this one is so down, even on this one. See, it's attached. So this strand is with your tapestry needle to sew it down, okay? If you like this tutorial and want to see more, please leave me in the comments below. I'm happy to help any requests, any suggestions. I'm happy here to help and receive them. Hey, remember to subscribe to the channel, hit the thumbs up, hit the little bell so that you know when I upload a new one. Okay, so bye. Thank you all and see you on the next one. Bye.